It's the size of a microwave oven, and it's hoped this new device could help reduce the costs of future space missions by allowing astronauts to manufacture spare parts in zero gravity. The American space agency NASA believes its new 3D printer will greatly reduce the need for astronauts to load up with every tool, spare part or supply they might need. Currently, all missions rely on supplies and equipment from Earth, but what 3D printing could offer is self-sustainable missions. 3D printing for the first time will give us an opportunity to build our own systems, our own components in space, to build the repair pieces, to manufacture the small parts that otherwise we'd have to wait, frankly, too long to get on a next space flight for resupply. Also known as additive manufacturing, 3D printing builds up objects layer by layer using polymer materials. But laser melted titanium and nickel chromium powders are now being used to make stronger components. Serving as a flying factory, the printer would have to be solid enough to withstand lift off vibrations and operate safely in a hostile space environment. The real challenge that we faced was designing a printer that would work in zero gravity. And all the printers today have been designed with gravity in mind. So what it came down to was ruggedizing every bit of that printer so that only parts moved when you needed it to move. Testing continues ahead of the next launch date in 2014. NASA plans to send the 3D printer to the International Space Station aboard a cargo resupply mission where the first creations will be studied for strength and accuracy.